I just got mail. It's cool mail, it's box shaped mail, it's sort of the size of a microwave mail. So without further ado, here's my mail. <laughs> Cool, right? These are all of the advanced reader copies of my book. I ordered 16 copies. These are still all uncorrected proofs, so only really the first half is proofread. I have yet to do a one glance over for any redundant sentences or dialogue tags that don't need to be there or things that I put in or my editor put in that I don't actually want to go into the final polished version. But I have started doing little art giveaways for people who are subscribed to my newsletter and I wanted to have enough arcs that I can give them to you and also give some big review journals that I am sending the book out to. So let's open this thing. I guess I'll film it as I'm opening it. I've never done an unboxing video before because that's a little bit too YouTube-y for my kind of YouTube but here goes nothing. Here's the upside down part of the box because I'm not giving away any personal information on the internet. And here's my pair of scissors. Guys, they look so good. They're in pretty decent shape. I think this spine is a little bit puckered. The Barnes & Noble paperbacks are really good, guys. Like, look, they got some pretty decent paperback floppiness. Like, compare this paperback floppiness to the floppy paperback that I got from Amazon. This one's floppier. It's interesting the Barnes & Noble ones are also a little bit thinner. I really like these. These are nice. If you are somebody who is gonna receive one of these 16 arcs, just make sure that you know that these are not the actual finished products of the book, but it's pretty close. Like, it's the same story. I'm just, you know, making a couple of name changes to towns or like fixing, you know, the occasional grammatical error here or there. Here's the front cover. It looks awesome. It's like a matte finish kind of touch to it. This is the spine. It's red. And this is the back. I have the tagline, the blurb, and also some content warnings down here. And then I have my title page. I have two title pages. I have the bigger title page with the name of my publishing house and also my name. Then I have the copyright page and then the other books written by this author page and my dedication and then my quote. And then you get the meat of the book. We got so many copies. Oh, and okay, here's another really cool thing. I printed these books through Barnes & Noble Press and they allow you to print personal copies of your book. So these are not retail copies of the book. These are just printed for my own personal use. This copy is from Amazon. As you can see, they have a bar across the front that says not for resale on it. And a lot of traditionally published arcs have a marking or a sticker or something on them that indicates that this is an advanced reader copy. So what I did is that I had these stickers made each of them says advanced review copy on it, and I'm gonna stick a sticker on every single one of the arcs that goes out. I am now gonna stick the first sticker onto my first arc ever. I'm gonna stick it in the corner so it doesn't hide anything. Try to stick it straight. Ta-da! Sorry, I know I'm saying this a lot, but I'm kind of going out of my mind right now. I'm really excited about it. If you want to win one of these, I'm giving out one art copy to a subscriber to my mailing list every single month. So if you haven't already, go over and subscribe to my mailing list. I've put the link in the description of the video and enter to win when I send the form out. All of the arcs that I'm going to be sending to people who win these giveaways are going to be signed with a personalized message attached to them. So that's it for this video. I just thought it would be fun to do a little impromptu thing. I'm going to go back to our regularly scheduled programming on Monday with more videos with writing tips, so just stay tuned for that. See you later, guys.